Lovely, beautiful morning. Lovely, isn't it? Beautiful spot with the old river. And a quite nice morning. <coughs> it's not too cold. Um, yeah, it's about seven degrees. And we're gonna go plan today, so we'll go and get hooked on. A lot of river. Bit of a treat today. Uh, we ain't got a yellow tractor, we've got the green, uh, got the green tractor. I'm gonna take the 724 out of the ark. Put you on there. Like so. See, there she is. But we're leaving um, a fast track will do a lot of row work this winter, so we try and balance the hours out by, you know, sharing the work. Like, you know, I could take the fast track today, but <coughs> um, the Fent won't do a huge amount of work this winter, so um, sort of balance the hours out a bit. We'll take the fence out. Which is no bad thing, I don't mind driving the fence. Let's just see if we can remember how to. <laughs> uh, right. Uh, park brake. Leighton. Looks like not easy to line up when you've got a camera on your head. Ah. Far off there. Are we still going down linkage or what? We are slowly going downwards. Oh, they're in a flight mode there, aren't they? Oh, we're nearly there. So green does, we want to put it in red. We'll put the float on red. Yeah. Bollocks in. All right, so there you go, we're ready to roll. Right, put the plan transport mode. Let's go and get out of here. 
Let me kick me. Let's rock on, Jolly. Yeah. It's a bit isn't it? <laughs> Alright, turn all the lights off. We want some flashes. That will do. do we? We're away. Cheers mate. Kill. Let's get on. Rightio. Put this plough into uh, work mode. Got my little uh, helper there as you can see. Right. First things first, we'll drop the plough down so we can put that top link back on, like so. Now we can lift it back up and take the uh, transport pin there. Well, you can't see it in the old drone, but take the transport pin out, like so. Now we need to flip it over. Right, so you can do the depth wheel now. Put that back into its other hole. Like so. Take these pins out so that the depth and uh, so they can work as the depth control, as the stops. And pull the pin out. There we go, we're ready to go, boys. straight line at a slight angle. It'll probably be a bit slick on top for the time being, but uh, once uh, on this first run, once I've cut a furrow, it should then, uh, we'll have a bit of traction, a bit of luck. Shall we?
too bad for me, is it? Yeah, C1, C1, C10. Oh, I love job for a start. Oh, we're getting on quite nicely there, boys. As you can see, where it's slabbed over, it's got shiny sides to the furrows. Um, this is basically this little bit here was where one of the muck inks was. That's why you can see it's all slabbed over. Um, obviously, it's a it's quite a good demonstration of compaction because obviously um, we've had a trailer here tipping and then we've had the loader and the muck spreader rear loading it back up again so this obviously this area has received a lot of compaction you can see exactly where it is you know it's compaction and there's sort of a line there and you're back into uncompacted soil where the muck heap wasn't bit of a drag through there but it is um, is dragging through so yeah now I've got a bit of a wibbly wobbly line but it ain't too bad I am by no means a perfect plowman but it is reasonably straight and if it does if it does get um, I do you know each each bout I do correct the wiggly bits um, and it's a it's a job forever correcting to be fair especially in ground you know ground like this where it does vary a lot um, and I'm going across the tram lines and and a lot of where these little kinks are are where tram lines are like so we've got a little kink here it's just where the tram line is it just drags the plow over a bit because it's a bit um, it's a bit tougher um, so yeah, you spend your day sort of correcting the keeper straight line. That's that's the that's the that's the goal anyway. So. Ooh. Is that a pee? Well, we're getting there now. We've only got 
just a little bit down here to do. The sun's nearly set, nearly on the horizon. Right, there's an interesting bit here I'm just going to show you. Now this area here, whether you can see it on camera or not, I'm not sure. Uh, this is where the second muck heap was. And this, there's been a muck heap here since sort of July time. Um, and let's have a look. Yeah, this is bone dry. There's not a bit of moisture in this. As I was ploughing it, it was, um, it was, um, uh, it was uh, making dust. It just goes to show you that, uh, you know, the, the, the rain that we have had the past six weeks hasn't made any inroads at all into this where this heap was. But as soon as you, I mean, look at that lump there, there's a fair old lump, there's, that is a bit damp there, let's pull that up from below, but uh, you can see where the where the outline of the muck heap was to a, you know, to a, to a tea lot, just along there and down. I just thought that was quite interesting. Just goes to show you, doesn't it? Anyway, we better crack on. I'm starting to get hungry now. Oh, we are just about done, we are. Got this uh, last headland to plow. And we're done. One thing I have noticed, the old, um, <coughs> even with the big, uh, even with the big weight on the front, the, the fence is a bit, um, a bit lower on the front compared to the fast track. It does, uh, it doesn't lift the wheels off the floor, but it does, it can leave uh, not a lot of weight on the front actually, if you know what I mean. So, um, just something I've noticed. So I didn't think it would do. I thought it'd be well planted with that uh, big old weight on the front. Yeah, this is a nine hectare field, so it's about 22 acres. And that's, uh, how long has that took us? We start at half nine, half 10, 11, 12, one, two, three, four, so five, six, seven, yeah, maybe about seven hours. Is it too bad of going? So there's some old um, some lights on in a minute, I think. Well, it's 20 past four now. The sun has been set for 20 minutes, I think. I think that went down about four. And give it half hour, it'll be pitch black. Oh, right, there we are, we're nearly done. Come on, sweetheart. Really step up this top end. There we go. We are all done did. Oh, well, let's tuck this old girl up for the night.
Then I can go home, get my tea. Well, we lock that. There we go. Drop the old front weight down. Well, jobs are good. Well, I hope you enjoyed that little vid. Thanks for coming and playing with me. And we'll see you on the next one. Ta-ta!